Warning, this video contains unbridled insanity. Viewing this video will cause cerebral hemorrhaging. Well, when the Pope was in town, you had a lot of uh, uh, people that were in favor of climate change. They in favor? In favor. There were people at the White House protesting in favor of climate change. Uh, what causes our country to go down and what causes our, uh, our country and our earth to be destroyed is sin. So what you are saying is sin is a greenhouse gas. Thorazine! Uh, you want uh, to change uh, the climate? Uh, stop sodomy. Uh, no, we don't want to change the climate. We want to stop the climate from changing. If changing the climate requires stopping sodomy, doesn't that mean that leaving the climate alone, we have to continue sodomy? Uh, you want to change the climate, uh, uh, stop abortion. So in other words, you're saying that the climate is static when abortions are occurring. Brother Dean, are you in favor of contraception? Freely available to anyone and everyone who asks for it? I bet you're not. If you are against abortion, you must therefore be in favor of contraception. Uh, these things are going to stop uh, that problem. So in other words, Brother Dean, you are telling us that abortions and butt sex keeps the climate from changing. This is something Al Gore never told us. And I damn sure wish that he had, because I would have done my part. Stop your sinning, uh, and please God, and then he'll bless our, our earth. Dude, you are talking about pleasing your God and sodomy in the same sentence. Yeah, uh, Dr. Freud, we have a emergency. Yes, stat. Love in the earth, love in their environment, instead of God. I can produce evidence that Earth exists. I can produce evidence that the environment exists. I can produce evidence showing if you destroy the environment, you harm people and other species. Okay, step forward. Produce some evidence that the gods exist. So the real issue is what's our relationship with God versus... Any relationship that doesn't involve sodomy, apparently. Versus what is my climate around me? That's right. I would rather have a sodomy-free relationship with a god than, I don't know, clean air, water to drink, uh, silly things like that. If they want to do something about climate change, what about all these? All this is cl uh, chemtrails up in the air right now. We watched them put, lay them out this morning. They've spread out. They they hide the sun from us. And tomorrow, these people will be standing in a flotation of, uh, of uh, aluminum. What? You're saying you're against abortion, sodomy, and chemtrails? Then what the fuck am I going to do for a job? I'm in charge of all that! President Obama, this is not Avon knocking at the door! This is God, once again! God is a fat, bald, white guy wearing sunglasses with a bullhorn. Getting your attention, reminding you that you your split hoof on that Bible when you were sworn into office, and President, you have disgraced God when you allowed same-sex marriage. Well, there he goes with that butt sex thing again. President Obama had jack shit all to do with same-sex marriage in the United States. In fact, same-sex marriage in the United States, by the federal government mandate, has always been legal since the United States was founded. Recently, the United States Supreme Court ruled that it is not constitutional to prohibit consenting adults from getting married. That includes same-sex couples. President Obama had nothing at all to do with that. If you want to take you and your family to hell, President, kindly do so, but don't take 
the entire country with you! I don't know, I think it would be a damn awesome place to visit myself. If you choose to go to hell, Obama, do not take our great nation with you! Because the airfare cost would increase the national debt! It's time for America to bring back the Ten Commandments, prayer in school, Boo. repentance, Boo. belief in Jesus Christ. Okay, Brother Dean, you can pray in public schools or you can follow the teachings of Jesus. You cannot do both at the same time. Jesus told you people to not pray in public. He told you to pray in private, specifically in a closet. So which is it, bro, Dean? And nothing personal. And nothing personal, and then that video stops suddenly. That's right, it's not personal. Standing at the White House with a bullhorn with big huge signs saying President Obama is going to hell and he's taking his family and the country with him and blasting through a bullhorn. Um, Terrible, terrible things about butt sex. But it's nothing personal. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it.